At this time, we would like to recognize four seniors who have a, who have been a fine representation of Hawaii athletics during their careers for the Rainbow Warrior basketball team. Here to help and honor our seniors are from the University of Hawaii Federal Credit Union, President and CEO Janine Morse, Member Services Manager Debbie Wilson, Branch Services Representative Alice Fasamora, Vice President of Marketing Barry Carroll, and Vice President of Member Support Charvis Bow. Well, before we start, we want to recognize Team Manager Kevin Flores. Our first honoree has been a member of the Rainbow Warrior basketball family for four years, redshirting his first season and littering the past three. He has been a part of four winning seasons, including three straight 20 win seasons and a post game, a postseason berth. For his career, he has been in action in 61 games. As a freshman, he put up nine points in just 14 minutes and a win against New Orleans, all three pointers. Mm -hmm. Derby prepped at Kamehameha Schools Kapalama, where he was a three-time All-State selection and Co-State Player of the Year as a senior. He will be graduating this spring with a degree in communications. Basketball fans, say aloha to the senior from Aiea, Oahu, number 10, Derby Enos. <laughs> Bring back a lot of good memories. As you can see, Derby Eno, a very appreciative home crowd. And just proud of this guy and also knowing him and his family. Great people, great individuals. And what a send off. You know, ending his career, a year of eligibility left. But he's going to pick up his degree in May, Johnny. And this is something that's very exciting for local fans here and big supporters of Derby Eno. Absolutely. Ha hats off to Derby. I actually coached his brother, Ryke. Unbelievable young man guys are and him to oh, finish school go. early just, just this is awesome to see i get chills every time to see him out here i think he's going to help him dunk here <laughs> get up derby derby Joining Derby on the court are his his mother Curry, brother Ryken, who played for UH, sisters Shelby and Taria, and grandparents Edward and Carol. Mother Carrie, Father Kai, Derby Enos, our next honoree, Grace the Bowes, with his presence in his first and only year with the program. Transferring from Arizona State, he played in every game this season for the Bulls. In UH's season opener versus Montana State, he burst onto the scene with 17 points off the bench, which included a career high five three pointers. He had seven double figure games and posted a double double in a win earlier this month against Cal State Fullerton. He's on pace to complete his graduate certification program in conflict resolution this summer. 
basketball fans, say aloha to the senior from Phoenix, Arizona, number 12, Sai Tumala. What a great senior year this kid had, having the opportunity to fulfill his college dream and, and actually contribute to a team, and he's contributed in a big way. Coming off the bench, unbelievable season. Hats off the side to Mal as well. He's a guy that's already been accepted to Creighton Medical School, waiting for Sai John Burns Medical Tumala. School. He is going to do well in whatever he decides or whatever uh, he ends up doing in the medical field. You know, that, it goes a lot to the type of character that he has. And, wow, what brain cells also in that dome of his of already being accepted. But uh, basketball IQ as well tonight. Big production off the bench. 16 points in a final home game for the Hawaii Warriors. And Sai so really played a big role in tonight's uh, victory here against Seastown. So a lot of credit to this guy coming in one year making such a great impact. UH Med School is set side tomorrow. Hey, hey, keep in mind, he's a role model for Indians. He's an Indian American, and, and there aren't a lot of Indian American basketball players. He's one of the few. Oh, he's, he's a great role model. Look at the love the crowd shows this guy. He's just been here only for a season. I love the show about the fans in Hawaii. You gotta love them all. Win or lose, they have your backs. And he's realizing and experiencing an event that no one, no one never experienced it before. And the third senior is finishing his third season with the Rainbow Warriors. Quincy has been part of UH's three straight 21 seasons after transferring from the City College of San Francisco. For his career, he played in 93 games with 30 starts, putting up over 500 points for his career and logging 214 steals. He is having his final season this year, starting all 27 games and developing into one of the Big West leaders in steals. He has had a career-high 18 points last month against UC Davis and recorded six steals against UC Santa Barbara, also a career-high in one of the Big West's top single-game performances this season. He will graduate this May in a degree of business management. Basketball fans, say hello to the senior from Antioch, California, number 11, Keith. I think without question, guys, the most improved Rainbow Warrior. You look at his career and how much better he got every year. And he's going to be a big factor depending on how far Hawaii goes. If Hawaii goes deep into the postseason, part of it will be because of uh, Quincy Smith. Absolutely. His development and growth over these past three years has been tremendous. He's he's grown as a person, player, individual. And how special is this? His father is going to throw him the alley-oop. <laughs> just playing against his brother. Unbelievable career, and it was questions about him coming into the year, and he, he shut all those questions down, had an unbelievable senior season. You know, and the way he played tonight, he started out at the point with Roderick not being able to start the basketball game. But what a senior, going out with double figures in his last home game. What a benefit to this program. And senior has put up historic numbers in his two seasons with the Bulls after transferring from Indian Hills Community College in Iowa. In his two seasons with the program, he has started 59 games with 185 field goals and 72 three-pointers. Last season, he set a UH record and became just the fourth Big West player to record, record 100 
steals in a season. For his efforts, he was named last year's Big West Defensive Player of the Year. Rod is just one of three players in UH history with a triple-double accomplishing that feat last season with 12 points, 10 assists, and 10 steals against UH Hilo. This year, he wowed the crowds at the Hawaiian Airlines Diamond Hit Classic, posting back-to-back 30-point -back games, including 32 points in a near win over then number three, Oklahoma. He will be graduating this May in a degree with family resources. Basketball fans, say aloha to the senior from Oakland, California, number five, R.D. Roderick. Bobby! Guys, I call him the maestro. He truly is. He leads the force, and he's the guy that gets the engine running. You know, and he's done it for the last two years, but you can see the emotion on Roger Bobby. You know, normally he's got that poker face on, but he really can sense the love from the crowd, and, you know, it made me kind of choke up a little watching his reaction to the type of love that was shown from the crowd and well deserved. Absolutely, guys. This, as he misses his last senior shot, he'll do it again. But this is one of the... Uh, I made my senior oh, shot, okay. All right. For the fans, this is one of the better players you're going to see that come out of this. This program at the Port Conference. Unbelievable two years here. No one knows what to expect when he came here. But from that first game he played and when he was down the stretch and he wanted the ball and knocked those free throws down in that first game, we knew he was going to be a special player. And he's just a great individual, great leader, great coach on the floor. And as we call him, the maestro. Sorry to see him go. As far as Ron is uh, concerned, he's not tall. He's got two more regular season games, the Big West Tournament, and then hopefully the Big Game. Uh, uh, no question. And Bill Wood is actually going to get a lot difficult, a lot more difficult going on the road. We've got UC Davis here. They pulled up an upset tonight against UC Irvine at home. And then, of course, that last game of Long Beach State. But what a tremendous show it was right here. You see his father in the crowd, of course, with his son. An amazing two-year career, unmatched in recent history. How great is this senior night at the University of Hawaii? The best. The best. Yep, absolutely. Exactly. I still have my ladies back in 